Carolyn is certainly one tough cookie. She personifies courage, character, and confidence. I know Carolyn because um, we work together on a lot of community issues and initiatives. Uh, you see Carolyn out all the time, whether it's uh, causes that are connected to um, the Science Center. I know that's one that she loves and has um, spent a lot of time and energy invested there, or the Parks, um, or the Leadership Louisville Center. She is everywhere all the time, putting her heart into this community. Um, and so we've had a lot of opportunities to work together just on the advancement of Louisville. I think the, the thing that stands out um, about Carolyn is that she has this incredible uh, ability to juggle so many responsibilities without uh, basically breaking a sweat. Uh, three very, very active children, a, a very demanding job which requires a lot of activity on her own part but also management uh, activity as well. So, uh, and I've seen it time after time after time when an event comes up and there's pressure to get uh, a lot of things organized, she does it with, uh, with great skill and uh, uh, seemingly, seemingly without effort, but I know there's an awful lot of effort that goes into it. I know that one of the things that is central to Girl Scouts is the idea of community service. I know that because I was a Girl Scout and I remember that as part of what was instilled in me early on. Uh, and Carolyn is really such a good exemplar of that. Not only does she believe in community service, but you can see that she is passing that on to her kids. When I see her out at community events, her kids are there with her. And when I see her at um, volunteer events, she's standing there right next to her kids. And I think that's incredibly important for good community leaders uh, because we really have to grow more. Our communities are only as good as the quality of the leaders that we have. So it's important for all of our community leaders to invest in that next generation. Uh, and just watching her do that with um, the young people that are in her house um, and connected to her is really exactly where we should all be um, doing good work. I am very, very fortunate that uh, she spent the last 10 years uh, helping me and in, in representing uh, the third district of Kentucky and uh, I don't know how I could have done it without her so uh, I owe her a lot and uh, I hope she's found the experiences as, as uh, rewarding as I've uh, I felt it was to be working with her.